All right, welcome back to some more GeoGuessr. I don't know why I'm starting in that voice. We're gonna do something a little different today. Just a new map. We're gonna see how well I know my city, the United States. Is that meme dead? I think that meme is dead. Well, cities within the United States, at least. US cities. Let's see what this one looks like. Medium on the difficulty chart. 304,000 have done this. None of your friends have played this map, but let's see. 20, oh, well. We gotta get a perfect score if we want to uh, get on the high score here, so that's probably not gonna happen. Oh well, it was worth checking. Let's see what we got here. Let's see how well I know cities in the United States. Where is this? This actually looks like it could be LA, if I'm being completely honest. That sign is very LA. That street sign is very LA looking. That building, building is very LA looking. Are we gonna actually get LA here on the very first hit? I, wait, am I gonna recognize the street here? Two freeway, which two freeways, plural. Wait, what street is this? It is Soto. Oh yeah, we do, we're definitely in LA right now. Just where exactly are we? Hold on, I gotta figure this one out. Looks like there is, it says freeways, we're that way. Uh, well, we have an exact address, 1241 South Soto Street, if only we can type that in. Okay, north on the five, south on the five. Dude, what are the odds of that? Eighth Street and the five freeway. Well, that's pretty easy right there. I was like, dude, this looks super LA. I'm very good at identifying just LA from any given spot. And I didn't say we were doing hardcore mode. I'm moving around on this one. So 8th Street at the 5 freeway would be like over here-ish, right? 8th Street and the 5. Soto, there we are. Oh boy, there we are. So we were on 8th Street to start. Let's go back to our starting point hold on 8th street and mott oh boy well hey we're off to a good start here ladies and gentlemen i think this could be a perfect 5000 so let's just make sure we were just dialing it down for that last point or two i'm thinking right about here if you don't give me 5000 i'm gonna be there we go perfect score thank you la thank you so much i appreciate it play the next round all right, where are, well, not so sure on this one. <laughs> Dart. Hmm. K. Bailey Hutchison Convention Center, Dallas. I wonder if we're in Dallas. Hmm. All right. <laughs> Great. Let us find Dallas over here and find the, I don't actually know where the convention center is, is the problem. It's got to be like right in here, right? Oh, Omni Dallas, which is right here, if I'm Omni, right? And then... So is this the convention center station? Cool. All right, so this is what street are we on right now? God damn, oh, it's blurred out. Why are you gonna blur out the street names on like street memorial? Okay, Memorial Drive is right there. So that's like we're entering, I think. Hold on, let's go back to the starting point, Memorial Drive. And our starting point is is our starting point a dead end? Wait, where the hell did I just go? Can I get a street sign anywhere? Good God, Dallas. Put some street signs down somewhere. Can I not go this way? Good Lord, where are your street signs? Anywhere? You guys just not put them on anything at all? Nice, cool. Let's go down the road a little bit, see if we can find a street sign somewhere. It'd be great. Maybe, maybe here? Oh my God, don't go there. Jesus Christ! Are you, well, okay, there's a freeway. Okay, this is the freeway. So we were on Griffin, That's, we just passed over the freeway. So we're definitely, uh, we're definitely on this side, right at the exit of the convention center, which means that we are literally, we're right here. Right there, give me 5,000, come on! 5,000, two in a row! Have I ever gotten two in a row, 5,000? on maps before. Granted, this is easier than the world map, but I think we're doing pretty well. Okay, what are we doing here? Van Deventer Service Center. That rhymes. That's pretty cool. Oh, oh. Ah, uh, Teresa, what, where are you running, though? It's great that you're running for a seat somewhere, but I don't know where, so how am I gonna, you know, possibly vote for you if I don't know where you are? You gotta give me some help here. Nobody wants to like mark off blank of barbershop of blank city for his glory church of blank city market. Uh, oh my God. Come on, you guys. Wait, greater Ville neighborhood. I don't know where Ville is. You could, you gotta get a little bit more specific than that. Seriously, nobody takes any pride in their location here. Nobody wants to name their business 
after where they are. Pimped out pickles. 50 picklicious, all pimped out flavors. This might be my favorite thing I have ever found on all of GeoGuessr. Hold on, we gotta, we gotta get a freeze frame for the thumbnail here of pimped out pickles. What is this? Pimped out pickles. Oh my, look at that! Look at that, it's a, it's a pickle pimp. I didn't, I never knew that this existed. Obviously, well not that like, I didn't know this store existed, but I did not know that there was a market for people who really like f differently flavored pickles. All the pimped out pickles, pimped out pickles open, now open. Oh, I hope it's still there. Guys, I hope that your business is going real well. I genuinely do. I want you to thrive. I just, I want him to never leave. I ne this needs to be preserved as a cultural historical monument. The pickle pimp, even if, it, even if pimped out pickles goes out of business, this needs to stay there. Even if it's the classiest restaurant in the world that opens up here afterwards, which doesn't necessarily look like it would be, but hey, you know, things could be trendy in like the arts district in LA. You got some weird looking buildings that have very fancy restaurants in them, so. Never know, I don't wanna judge. But even if it goes away, that needs to stay. Pimped out pickles, if only you guys were pimped out pickles of blank. Oh, really, come on. Here, oh, 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 oh wait, hold on. Do we have any information? Eightways.w, are we in, is this like St. Louis by any chance? STL, St. Louis? I don't know what the W-U is. This looks like it could be St. Louis. I've been to St. Louis, and there's a West End in St. Louis. Could be. I, you know, it's gonna be more impressive if I just put a pin down in St. Louis and it's correct than if I keep going around the map until I find definitive evidence. Yes, it's gonna ruin my perfect score, but won't you guys be impressed if just based upon what I've seen so far, I'm actually correct in saying St. Louis? You're gonna be impressed. Now, let's look if there's like a, if we can find where it says like West End or something here, because I think that exists. Central West End, huh, oh, oh. We're just, you know what, let's just throw it down right on Central West End and hope for the best. Yo, I am a god. Oh, god damn it. Dr. Martin Luther King Drive, that's what we were on. Oh my god. And Van Deventer, damn it. If I had just like spent two more seconds and actually looked at street names, I would have recognized him right there. I am, I am incredible. I am a god. How do you like them apples? That, wow. How do you like them apples though? I got St. How did I get St. Louis from that? You boy. All right. Uh, yeah, I don't mean to toot my own horn, but that's uh, pretty great. That's pretty great. Okay. So where are we now? This is gonna be a little bit more difficult. Looks like we're in uh, suburbia, North Twenty Fourth Street. You know, at the very least, uh, we're probably gonna get fifteen thousand points, which in any other round would would be decent, especially if it's hardcore mode. Ooh. Oh, dude, that's a nasty dip right there. I just want to point this out. You see those little lines on the road? That means there's a dip there, and cars are scraping their noses. You guys got to be careful. You, If you are approaching a dip in the road, and you're not sure if your car is going to hit or not, you go at an angle. It's very crucial. Very big deal. I see too many cars just go <laughs> slam right into dips and just keep... I'm like, how do you guys not realize that that's going to be a thing that happens? I'm sure some people just genuinely don't care, but I don't like to damage my cars. So uh, I'm, I have a pothole map of LA in my head. I should create an app that maps out the potholes. You like put your phone on your dashboard in your car and it starts doing like a red alert when you're approaching a bad one. How amazing would that be? Man, don't steal that idea. I could make a billion dollars off of it. Or honestly, do steal that idea because I make use of it. And it would probably take a lot of time to make. So if someone else does it, just Give me a few percent, a few shares. That'd be that'd be sweet if you do that. All right, where are we where are we at here? Come on. Oh, okay, more more industrial uh, area over here. Pretty cool, pretty cool. Anybody want to identify the location here? I don't know if I'm gonna get as lucky as I did with the whole St. Louis thing. Lutheran Family Services Health Three of of. Oh, I swear to God, it says of, but I can't read the rest. Damn you. Catholic Social Services of Southern Nebraska. Are we in Omaha? <clears throat> Southern-ish Nebraska, Omaha, or Lincoln? <clears throat> Let's see. If we go into Omaha here. Let's check out how, I mean, oh, Q, wait, 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 wait. There was a Q Street somewhere nearby that we were just on, right? And now, is this 72nd by any chance? No, because that's 22nd and they'd be going parallel, right? 
Oh, this is O. Oh, this is O Street. Where O Street seems pretty big though. Are we sure it's Q or O and not? It looks like O, but I could be wrong. Do they go in alphabetical order at all by any chance? Q, O. Q Street looks, it's so much bigger. Wait, okay, O Street at 22nd. Where's 22nd? Hold on, but 22nd and O Street, 22nd is dead ending. Oh man, is that not it? There's seriously a 22nd and O in another city in Nebraska. Yeah, oh, 22nd and O. Okay, so I'm not misreading. It's definitely O and not Q, except this doesn't match. Are you serious right now? How is that gonna, let's go to Lincoln and see if you guys just follow the same naming scheme. You guys, oh, wait, okay, and then, oh, oh. God, you guys are so boring with your street names. I realize it's like easy to do that, but, oh, hey, it should be easier to find, 22nd. Oh, wait, you are, oh, 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 there it is. I think, hold on, mom's liquor. Wow, thank you guys, actually. You know what, I was giving you some shit before for having the same naming scheme, but now I appreciate it, I really do. So where was our starting point, though? We were at, because I, I strayed pretty far away, uh, North 24th Street, and which, uh, would you like to give me a street sign here? Uh, going the other way? Yes, would you like to do S, 24th and S. Dope, right here! Oh, that's cool, okay, so we, must be, if we go back to flag, means we are right at the alleyway, which, is this the alleyway? I hope this is the alleyway, because other one, wait, oh god, uh, hold on. If we go that way is, so, mm -hmm, which means that, well, if we drive that way, so that means that is that side of the road, this is that side, so we are here, right about, like right there. Come on, give me 5,000. That's what I'm talking about. Thank you, Lincoln and Omaha for having the exact same intersection, but just slightly different, you know, dead end versus not. It's actually very good. Starting off in an alleyway here, Matic Place. Okay, we're we're real downtown somewhere here. Cultural Loop. I feel like it's gotta, this has gotta be one that's gonna be easy to figure out. Uh, Benham Center, come on, but where are we? How, we, really, it is surprising how difficult it can be to find out exactly where you are. Like right in smack in the middle of a very populated area. Okay, how much are we gonna have to move around to figure this out? The 570, I think we're on the East Coast though, because of the, because of the just an innate feeling. I feel like we're on the East Coast. Let's find, I don't know, I'm gonna look up like Philadelphia or something like that and see if we've got any of those highways there. 376 and 579. No, we don't. No, we do not. Three, let's look around for 376. I don't know why when we're in such a populated area, this would be so hard to find. It makes no sense. Where is, give me some information. This is so embarrassing that nothing here that I've been able to see so far. Pittsburgh, I, I was kind of close. I was kind of close with the whole Philadelphia guess. So we are in Pittsburgh and that means where is, uh, oh, 376, there it is. It's gotta be like right in downtown, right? 579, 376. Okay, so we are right, we're right there. We're like right in here somewhere. Let's go back to our starting point. Look for a street. Cause I was thinking like Stan, the, the Penguins, they do pretty well, right? And their recent Stanley Cup finalists or winners or something, I don't know, I don't follow hockey, but um, a couple people I follow on Twitter are big on hockey. And so I inevitably catch some of it. Penn and seventh. Is this seventh right here? Sixth and seventh. Willie, it's Penn Ave though. Uh, oh, there's Penn Ave. Okay, okay. Got it, got it, got it, got it. So we're on Penn, we're on Penn Avenue. This is 9th, that's 7th, and we exited right here from this alleyway in the middle of the two closest to 9th Street. So it's like right here, right here, and then back a little bit into actually which way. So if 9th Street is there, um, and we're going to 7th, it's gonna be on the left. So that means we're like in here. And where did we start off? That is seventh. Oh, wait, oh, 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 almost messed that one up. Uh, so we are not there. Instead, we are 
right here, I think. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're right, we're right in there. Okay, okay. Let's go back there. See how far we are from the street. Just oh, this is gonna be a tough guess, but I think if we scale, we're getting, we're going for that last point here. All right, right there. Come on, give me five thousand. Junior Explorer, way to go. That's five games you're starting. Oh, okay. We got five thousand points once again. Game finished. Two thousand four hundred. 24,000, I know how to read, 978. If only I had paid like slightly closer attention to the streets in St. Louis. Oh, I could have gotten a perfect score. I don't know if I would have shown up on the leaderboard because I'm sure a lot of other people beyond the first four or so have also gotten perfects, but oh, did pretty well. Did okay, not bad. Look, everything's like right on the money there. Look at all those flags, beautiful. Well, that's it for this round of GeoGuessr. I hope you've enjoyed. If you want to watch more of these GeoGuessr videos, there's a playlist in the description. And subscribe if you're not already. And um, yeah, if you want to listen to the music playing in the background right now, it's linked in the outro over on the Marin Music channel and in the description, all that stuff. I'll see you next time.